Hello again, welcome back to another daily buying advisor repentance. <clears throat> Excuse me, it's uh September 14, 2022. Alright, it's another Isaac day. So we lost the challenge. Of course we lost the challenge. We always lose the challenge. Frogmo's just devil. Isaac rebuilt. Did the tower offense. Let's try the Isaac rebuilt, maybe. These are challenges are rather annoying. I got another update, huh? Or is this just the same thing? Hunting pennies, two new chests. Okay, this looks like a new update. Big fan of scuzzies? Now you can tame them. They also brought a new friends. Just more stuff for me to figure out. All right. You know what? Let's. I'm gonna actually just do something different here. One second. I'm gonna install a mod. I think it's about time I install another mod here. It's gonna help me with freaking keeping track of these items. Shiny gold. Interesting. Um, I don't know what's called. Item description. Eternal item description. I don't know if that's it. Does not something. All right, probably means it does not work. I guess we're just going to home, most popular, very tinted rocks, folio. Able to see the rocks better. All right, you know what? Why not? Why not? <laughs> Slower glitch crown reroll. Uh huh. Uh, whatever. Okay, why am I just getting a bunch of dog shit items? And this is like supposed to be the oh most popular in a week. Uh, how about old time? That's why. Planetarium chance. Uh, sure. Uh, it's long as it doesn't break the mod here. Enhanced boss bars. Sure. Boss wave counter, sure. Death animation. No, I'm looking for something here. Hanging Dreamcatcher, no. Encyclopedia, no. No, what like how is this not lying the top? No, oh my goodness, there's so much. Rehud, no. Oh boy, let's see. I'm gonna pause here for a second till I find it. Okay, here we go. Now I'm back. Abled some mods. Why do I have her? What? Why do I have her? <laughs> it's a continue. I didn't do that. All right, let's see. Um, uh, let's do the feigned, I guess, again. All right. Seed here is C4, ZM, X1, ZS. Do you want to lock some content behind achievements? Sure. King of Mine or something? What the fuck is that? A, a new door? See, there's that black heart thing from that last, last update. 
anyways, what I've been up to. I did some running today. Just gotta go and uh, eat some broccoli. I'm kind of tired right now after running and doing a bunch of other things today. It's, it's, uh, it's been fairly busy for sure. Okay, where's the black heart? Excuse me? Oh no, we changed it so you don't get it. Alright, now we can figure out what the hell this item is. Luck effect and chance to shoot sewing needle tears that pierce and inflict enemies with sewn. Sewn enemies reflect damage. Okay, I remember that one. Oh, we got both of these. Alright. Yeah, I decided to just install this mod because it's like, you know, I'm getting annoyed with how this is set up. And I got the planetarium chance and some other things too. It's wicked sick. Weather's been kind of nice today. For now. It's been cooling off, so yeah gonna be even cooler next week i'm like already really heading that threshold so we went to mom's heart with this character we also did grade mode and it sucks that I can't... Oh, no! There it is! If I, it looks like as though I haven't even completed it. What the hell? Did the patch, like, take away my unlocks then? Is that what happened? Wow, shit. Had a great grade run, and then I... I get duped. Well, at least the postage note work, I guess. Works. Monies, honeys. That's why I was just getting, like, achievements again. Little pop-up shop. I guess we'll take that. Thank you, Satan. This character is rather annoying, though, nonetheless. I get the gimmick. Oh, if you get hit, you lose your heart, and you'll go and chase after whatever, and then you may or may not get it again. Unless if it's a uh, purple heart. It's sewing needle time, which won't really do much because there's not an, another en enemy to, to like stick it to and then do that increased damage stuff. Oh, wait a minute, maybe. And it didn't look like it did much. Yeah, it's supposed to rain on Friday too, so that could just disrupt things with my running. A little bit. I might just go swimming instead. If that, if that happens. Ah, I guess we'll go down the next floor this way. Damage is not bad. I need tears though. And somehow like a big health generator. Like a book of... Uh, Like a book of revelations or something like that with car battery. Parasitoid tier is definitely taking that. Or parasite, whatever. You know what I mean. Oh, fuck off. Oh, 
I don't understand why there's a difference between like getting a half a heart or not. Damn. And I'm not taking the spicy keys. I could have teleported out, but whatever. I'm lazy. <laughs> Oh, he's so lazy. That's funny. Well, they should give me two. Oh, okay. That lit him on fire. That's fun. Um, well, they also should give... Are oh, you fucking kidding me? You're giving my black card back. That's funny. They should give me, like... Not late. And a familiar that's gonna be sufficient enough to like take on something. Dart actually really need the onk with me though. Okay, there's car battery. Now can I afford it? Oh funny. Ain't so funny. If we can afford it. That'd be great. I don't think I will be able to afford it, unfortunately. Unless we get, like, pageant boy. And that's if the pageant boy pays out with enough. Or I get, a, like, a bomb and I can bomb the donation machine. Like, that's a little obvious with that regular tenor rock. They could just, just do it with the rig the other rocks. A coin is not enough. I'm sorry to say, it's not enough. Oh, that's interesting. You can just hold that down. I can tell you what things you currently have holding on there. Actually, you know what? Golden Plum? We're going to take the Golden Plum flute. That's ev evidently a thing. Though, if I kill him, do I get money, though? I'm taking the flute anyways. I'm going to get that unlocked. I already had the regular flute. There we go. I'm just going to check. Grudge familiar moves out like a pokey. Charges on double tap. I've had that item before. I am not getting that. Damn shame we can't get the car battery. A damn shame. I guess we just check in here. What the fuck is this? All right, just a dead fish. Nothing unusual about that. All right. So, someone's friendly golden plum for the current room for 10 seconds. Yeah, I figured that was the only effect. Should still be kind of useful for the most part. That car battery be two of them. Uh oh. Uh oh. Guys, got any spooky plans for Halloweens? I really don't. Last time I went out trick-or-treating was like, when I was like 16, I think. 15, 16, might have been 16. Maybe 15, something like that. It's been a while. I remember taking people out for trick-or-treating too. They were younger than me. I'm like, that was kind of awkward. Cause it's like taking them out trick-or-treating. I only took them out like around like one block or something. Cause I, I don't know how they were. And I don't know if they were pretty satisfied or not with that. Oh, wow. Creases the radius of what? A friendly creep. Oh, is that what that does? See, I keep forgetting about what that thing does, that trinket. I should be knowing that. Luck up. 
I guess it's such an obscure trinket that it doesn't like matter too much. When, oh, you fucking kidding me. I like how it takes like a heart and a half out of me. One of the worst spots for an enemy to hide there. That's it, take the money from me. Haha. <laughs> Oh, I can't get to that. <laughs> you call yourself an Isaac connoisseur, and here you are just... freaking losing, loser. I don't get why, like, I get... Some health if I throw it at an enemy and kill him, and other times I get nothing. This is just a chance base lane then. Is that the dealio? All right. I also put a mod on too that acts very similar to like the donation machine where you can just like donate really fast to beggars and other stuff. And I like that. I just, I'm surprised I never like decided to get it. Because that would have made things like a lot faster and less of a hassle. Okay, so we found that room. So we already established the sicker room's not there on the left. Or right, I mean. Alright. Now we just go to the right then. Oh, Hocus Pocus comes out in about two weeks. Or is it three weeks? Nah, it's gotta be like about two weeks, right? It's gotta be. I've seen there's like another Star Wars movie or television episode. I don't know what it is. I've seen like an advertising on a television screen when I was out and about. I'm like, what is this? Also, carrots. All right. He just won't die until you kill everything else, huh? Annoying. Now, does this give me a different item description? Yeah, it doubles the trinkets effects. Woohoo. Well, wait a minute. It should work. Because I'm not the other character, the rock guy. Assuming that Curse Penny. I don't know about that shit. Um I'll tell you what, we'll take this. We'll come back. I think we'll grab the box and skip the flute. But I wanna use this at least for the boss fight. Just to be certain that I uh, I don't get caught off guard by something nasty. Okay, that's not too bad. Except it's a champion, so I gotta be careful. All right. And there he goes. Whatever. How many speed upgrades? Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, the big ass speed upgrade is actually fantastic. Oh, big old boy. <laughs> big old flick. Yeah, I think this makes more sense to take this with me. More luck upgrades, more chances to find a better trinket. Something. Blue baby is not that very trinket I need, so all right. Down we go. I'm thinking probably go to Isaac or go to. I'm gonna think maybe it's here. Damn. Show held off. I think I should go to like Isaac the fight or the lamb, depending on how powerful I feel. 
There we go. Still got the scales. Three dollar bill's been helping a little bit here. Double supplies. Well, I don't have any creep, so. Oh, come on, you dirty bug. That was close. <laughs> Gone. You know, that's not bad. All right, now I'm curious about this light switch. Pl pays out with coins after using an increasing amount of time. See, that's exactly what I assumed that did, because I had it the last time, and it worked. It worked that very way. All right, let's try this. Oh, you little fucker. Oh my goodness gracious. Good lord almighty. No, no, no. We're going to take this. Because from what I can gather, this is going to give me more, better devil deal stuff. Thanks to the box. Assuming that stacks that way. Edmund, I hope you stacked it like that. This room just annoying as hell. They're dead. I don't know what they're doing there. They're all having a fit. Uh, stop me give me give me uh it'll stop giving me any more space bars that's not all inherently bad but i think this one is trinket though <laughs> annihilated you've been terminated Prevents qual- Oh, wait a minute. It prevents quality zero items from spawning. Space bars and quality zero items. It's actually pretty good. There's a lot of quality zero items. Batty. Yeah, I remember you. I hate you. Like, I don't have... I don't have the stats to deal with your ass. So easily. Like, I got the speed that helps. Bad shit. <laughs> no! Alright, out of here. Get that... Get... <laughs> The devil deal. It would be funny if we get Krampus. See, this is what I know. I can't get bone hearts. <laughs> well, there we go. That's what you get for dropping a trinket. So, does this also apply to devil deals then? I'm going to assume yeah. So, we probably won't get a space bar. We'll get a like, lump of coal. Yeah, look at that. I mean, that's not entirely bad, but not the greatest either. Uh, killing the petrified enemy, cuties assist, yeah, yeah, ice cube. All right, we need to go back and look for our item room now. I can't leave that behind. Oh, fuck. Oh, fire mind. I, I wouldn't mind getting fire mind, though. Just something they... I know where you are, Satan. Uh oh. Ron Penny, not good enough. That's a tears up finally. And there is a vault. The vault of glass. By the way, I found out recently that they've made 
a remake of the Oryx Raid in Destiny 2. Like, Bungie made a remake. So I guess they're remaking all the old raids from Destiny 1 and releasing them slowly. Which, I mean... <laughs> From what it looks like to me, it looks like it's still the same, how it functions. So I watched a video and someone was like jumping on the platform stuff for the end game boss, the Oryx fight. I'm like, yeah, I remember that. It used to be orb instead of like the platform lighting up, I think. Or the platform would light up in Destiny 1, but then you, they would also have like an orb or something there on it as a better indicator. Right, I guess we just grab this. So that means there's probably going to be. I'm trying to think here. Well, there's that one raid I haven't done in Destiny 1, because I stopped playing around that time. That was back in 2016. So I never played that last raid, but I played the Kel stuff. The uh, Essentially what that was, was uh, fighting a bunch of wave after wave of nonsense. I don't know if they're going to introduce that back again, or if they're just going to skip it and go for the other raid. Because I guess they did the Crota one. They did the Vault of Glass, I know that. I've seen videos on that. You get your Calahorn, you go right at it. I actually ran into a video talking about Destiny 1. Like, rarest weapons, and I got, like, most of those. Oh, all right, not, not that item. And so, one of the things we were talking about was, of course, the Galahorn. It was talking about how Zura was selling it the second week and nobody knew about it. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, of course nobody knew about it. Because, like, nobody had the damn thing. Almost nobody had the damn thing at the time. All right, this is annoying. All right, fuck right off, Satan. All right, I can't kill him unless I kill everything else, right? Yeah. That was annoying as shit. I hate those enemies. What in the fuck is going on? <laughs> Every time they have an update or something going on, there's always some new crap. What is this? Angry fa fake? Floor bosses and many bosses have increased HP, but also drop more hearts on death. Yeah, hearts, red hearts, I imagine. All right, now what's this? This is a soccer card, right? It's not telling me what it is. Maybe it can't because... Some of the soccer ball can be knocked around to damage enemies. Well, I mean, that's pretty straightforward, I suppose. All right, I guess we'll take the fanny pack. Maybe the fanny pack could give me some leverage. I mean, they had... Let's see. No, actually, no. There's another one. There's another one in Destiny 1, I think. Right? No, that was Oryx. I was, I was thinking the ship and stuff, but that was an Oryx. That was Oryx. It's been a while. Yeah, bad trips, like, no. All right, well. Am I getting hurt by the ghosts? All right. It's annoying. Get it. Uh-oh. Yeah, I remember the Oryx raid. And I how I had to, like... Find different people to help me with it. It's plus six in the luck-based tier effect. 
Well, I don't have any tiers that apply to that. Guess we'll go down and we can go to the fight now. Oh, it's the brains. The brains from freaking What's that game it called? Fall New Vegas DLC. It's the mines. These guys are fucking annoying. Can I say that for for a fact? Th these guys are just absolutely terrible. So much health. Can I can I just say that for a fact that there's just so much health for these guys? Like a lot of these bosses they have a lot more health than they should be. Should have. I don't know. Anyways, thanks for watching, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.